and do the chums to Zion Captain of the Steves and today chums this is a follow-up video to my Zendesk video so yeah on the screen you're probably gonna see all my Zendesk logs scrolling along and there's a heck of a lot of them there's a heck of a lot of them now at one point I used to have my own login at the top of the actual Zendesk there was a signing button you could sign in and register and once logged in you could see all of your sort of issues that you had submitted on a sort of page sort of form and it did have a status there but those statuses never changed even after patches came out and i could see some of those got fixed they didn't change to fix they didn't change to resolve to nothing like that now if the zendesk is anything like other platforms like service now you can set up a master ticket and then you can link all associated tickets and even look for keywords to help you associate tickets to other tickets and then when you close the master it closes them all down I would like to have hoped that there would be something like that inside of the old Zendesk, but I don't know enough about Zendesk to know, to be honest, people. My main gripe with contacting Hello Games is it's a tool for communication, yet the communication only seems to flow one way, or if it doesn't, and you do get a reply from Hello Games, it's only on very complex type ones from what I'm seeing inside of my polls that I put out on side of my community tab. If you don't use my community tab on YouTube, there's all sorts on there. You can see that scrolling right now. There's some interesting polls there where I'm asking for your feedback. What game would you like to see brought to my channel in September? Yes, Robocop and Cyberpunk DLC are sort of going toe to toe at the moment thank you yes, but there's also bolt gunner by uh, you know, warhammer 40k i used to paint those figures for warhammer all day long when i was a youngster anyway back to zendesk <laughs> because zendesk I, although it's a tool for communication like i say it only goes really one way and uh, i would like to see some sort of interactions from hello games even if it just went to work in progress so you knew that they were working on your actual bug i mean if i submitted a bug over to them and i saw it change to work in progress i could do a follow-up video for you guys or if i see it move to closed i can do a follow-up video for you guys it's additional content especially in dry spells so we can look at what's coming in the next patches that's where i'm going with this people what do you think sound off in the comments salute mondo cheery bye